These are the built-in microphones on the Tascam DR70D using the camera output and a regular cable. Testing. One, two, three. These are the built-in microphones on the Tascam DR70D using the camera output and a SESCOM cable. Testing. One, two, three. Okay, the two clips you just watched were both of the Tascam DR70D. In the first clip, the DR70D had a regular mini-to-mini -mini audio cable plugged into its camera out port, and that was plugged into a Canon 7D Mark II. In the second clip, the Tascam DR70D had a SESCOM cable plugged into its camera out port, and that also was plugged into a Canon 7D Mark II. And you may have noticed that in the first clip there was a bunch of noise, and in the second clip there was much less noise. There was still a little bit of noise, but it was much, much better. If you're planning on using the Tascam DR70D with its camera output feature to plug into your DSLR or mirrorless camera, I would definitely recommend getting a SESCOM cable instead of using just a mini plug cable because there's a noise issue there, and the SESCOM cable corrects most of it. You can buy a SESCOM cable if you look in the description of this video. I have a link there where you can buy it. Let's check out those clips again, but I'd also like to point out that this voiceover is being recorded with the built-in mic on a Tascam DR7DD. I'm in a half bath powder room in my apartment. That's why it sounds kind of echoey. Here's my sink to prove it. Very nice. But anyway, let's watch those clips again, and also you should visit my blog, sammallory.com. All right, bye guys and girls. These are the built-in microphones on the Tascam DR70D using the camera output and a regular cable. Testing, one, two, three. These are the built-in microphones on the Tascam DR70D using the camera output and a SESCOM cable. Testing, one, two, three. These are the built-in microphones on the Tascam DR70D. Testing, one, two, three.